Hey Glam Beauties, welcome back to my channel, Madam CJ Bam Glam. I'm here to bring you a small Dollar Tree and Ulta haul. It is Saturday morning. I'm filming my second video of the day. That is surprising. But I need to get a lot of things done today. So without further ado, let's get started with this here Dollar Tree haul. I'm going to start off with a product that um, I don't like the most uh and that is this this body cream uh french uh lavender and citrus it's a uh really a lotion i really don't like the consistency of it um that's why i want for new products i like to at least get one just to see how it is i mean it's pretty thick but i mean i'm gonna use it up and if I like it then, but it's not, I really don't care for it. And this is the Bolero. That's what I wanted. Uh, got a lot of stuff uh, from Dollar Tree, the Bolero products. These are new products that I've seen. I was just going just to get some more uh, of their soap. That soap is wonderful. I have showered with that soap six times now, and it's still humongous. <laughs> So I went to go get some more and then I seen that they had different uh, fragrances out. So I just got one of each and I'm going to try those. But this is one that I really don't care for. This is just another oil that I haven't used yet. So I'm going to try this so far like all of the other ones. And then this is a new one that I seen. The Coconut and Cream and Vanilla Body Oil. This one I want to try this here. Okay, and then these are uh, some new facial wipes that I've seen. I just picked up the French Lavender and Citrus. And I picked up two of those. I can't go wrong with the wipes. I do know that. Okay, then I picked up this here body scrub. I'm going to use this when I take a shower. Uh, this is the Coconut Cream and Vanilla Body Scrub with Coffee Powder. I love my coffee, so I'm wondering how this is going to be. Let's see how the consistency is. Mm. Well, let me. Where's my little? Oh gosh, I don't have it with me. Give me a moment. Okay, here we go. Let's see how that is. Ooh, it's jelly like. It's clear. So let's see how this is. Oh, I love the way that feel. It's definitely an uh, exfoliator, that's for sure. But that's nice. Let me clean my hand. Okay. So I may like that. I'm going uh, to try it out when I take my shower. So this one, I was really surprised about. This is the... Body polish, coconut oil, and sea salt. I thought this was like a, a body cream. A well, let me see. Hold on, not a body cream. Um, body butter. I think I just said that, like uh the body shop, but it wasn't. This is how it Three, looked. Two, uh -oh. oh my God! No, I didn't. It's so liquidy. So that's how that look. Oh, I just made a mess. Well, we'll get that off. Let me pause it. Okay, I done cleaned up that mess. So this is another one. This is uh, a coconut cream and, and vanilla gentle face scrub. I haven't opened this up either. Just want to see how the consistency is on this. Mm. Hope y'all having a great morning. I'm really tired, exhausted, but I have a lot to do today, including cleaning up. So, okay. Oh, that's nice. I like that scrub also. It's pretty nice. 
so I think I'm going to enjoy this one too. Okay, now let's get what what I am familiar with is the soap. Oh, this lavender. This here soap that I had uh hauled um in one of my previous Dollar Tree videos. This is nice. And I love the lavender scent that's on here. It's really nice. And then this here, this is a new one. I haven't tried this yet. And then this is one that I hadn't seen. This is the Cranberry and Sweet Orange. I know on my last Dollar Tree haul, I purchased the um, wipes. So can't wait to see how this one is. And then this one here, this Vanilla and Cream. Can't wait for this. Can't wait, can't wait. Well, moving along, uh, I went into Ulta to find, uh, because I, they, received, they sent me a coupon for $5 off of L'Oreal Foundation. So when I normally use 110 and 111, they didn't have a 110, and 110 is what I really needed. So I asked a sales associate to go back there and see if uh, they have it in stock. She said that they were going to discontinue L'Oreal so they don't have it in stock which that's a bomber, but with that being said, a lot of their L'Oreal products are 70% off. So I purchased a lot of stuff that they had, and it was mainly everything that was $2.99. So I ended up getting my foundation. This is a backup because I already, I'm using one now. And then I got these here concealers. These are the True Match uh, concealers. I have one in, what is this, W678. Actually, I have two of those. And then I have one for my clients. And this is going to be, what is this? Uh, in uh, one, two, three, this is the lightest shade. Oops, turn that around. That's the lightest shade. And then I have this one here for myself too, which is an N45. Let me see if I put my light over here. Yeah, that's a little bit too much light. Let me adjust this here a little bit more. Mm. Well, I have two that um, that I'm going to... Let me see. I think this is one that I opened. Yeah, this is one that I opened. Do a little swatch. Let's see. I'm going to use this up under my brow bone. And then I think this one here is one that I open up also. Or not. Let's see. Yeah, this is one. Okay. Oh, yeah. This definitely would be a highlighter for me. That would go... Uh, up under my eyes for sure okay so with that being said uh i like doing editorial looks and i purchased these here and again these were originally originally 9.99 i got everything for 2.99 so i pay uh purchased these infallible paints all of these here colors here and I'm going, I swatched the white to, because I uh, read a lot of reviews and, you know, it was mixed feelings on these reviews. So I said I wanted to try it myself and I did, you know, it it's a build up. It's a build up, but for what I needed for, it'll work. That's a swatch on that. Just in case, you know, these are eyeliners, of course. Let me go on and open up this here because I'm going to be using these here to incorporate in a lot of my looks. Oh, that blue is gorgeous. You know, that's why you, I love reviews, but I like to go out and purchase some for myself. Because that's one thing about Alta. They have a 60-day return 
uh, policy, so you can't go wrong. And I'm going to open up these other ones without my hands being in the camera. Let me get these here open real quick. So I would like to say uh, thank you to my new subscribers. Uh, thank you to my old subscribers for sticking with me. I really appreciate it. Uh, you looking out for a sister? Okay, the, let's go back to this one here. The white one was, uh, it's called White Party. Can you see that? White Party. And the blue one that I use is called Electric Blue. Oh, I'm going to love these. I'm going to have to go pick up some more. And uh, Trepid Teal is the one I'm getting ready to use now. Let's see. Oh, I like that. That is nice. That is nice. I'm trying to uh, inc I'm trying to incorporate um, a Dallas Cowboy look uh, that I'm gonna post on Instagram. So that's why I needed you know this white one. The one that I'm getting ready to use now is called Wild Green. Wild Green. Oh, that's gorgeous. 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 So I'm going to put these in my colored eyeliner draw. And these here are some more uh, eyeliners. And like I said, everything was $2.99. I think these were originally uh, $9.99 also. But this one here is what... Uh, galactic metal which i'm gonna swatch it and this one it is solar gold solar gold and this one is cosmic purple so i'm gonna swatch these also i'm probably gonna go uh to a couple of more oh they had some foundation and everything but uh and I think it was the true match. I'm I'm really not uh gonna purchase that uh foundation because I really don't know how it is and I don't I have enough foundation now uh that I'm not using that I need to use. And like I said, I kinda stick with uh my holy grails. I stick with what I know, you know. I know at my job, I use the Urban Decay, and I love that, but I don't have any in my, you know, my stash, which I need to get it. Excuse the noise, because I'm trying to open up this here, and this, this, <laughs> excuse, I'm getting tired of tongue. Oh, I love um, this. Oh, that's so, you see the sparkles in that? That is so Gorgeous. I wonder if the uh, the eyeliners like that. This is a good buy. Two ninety nine. Oh yeah. See how precise that is. You can control it for a wing. Let me deepen it so you will be able to see. Oh, that's nice. I like that. I mean the uh. Camera's not doing the justice, but it's nice. I, yeah, I think I will be picking up a few more of these here. Especially with the, oh, that's, let me see. Ooh, that is, that's beautiful. I know you're not going to be able to see this because it looks so uh, transparent. You really can't hardly see it, but that gold. Oh, yeah, you, that, there you go. There you go. And I'm quite sure when it dry down, it's going to be really nice. That is nice. I think I'm going to do a cut crease with this here. With that gold. And of course, my favorite color. Oh. 
Oh, oh, look how beautiful that is. Oh, look how gorgeous that is. Just beautiful, just beautiful, just beautiful, just beautiful. And my last little uh, purchase at uh, Alta for two ninety nine, and I do believe I have this here um, in two hundred. I believe I do. If I do have it, I'm going to put this in a future giveaway because it makes no sense of me having two, three, or four of these here highlighters. I have a mask uh, highlighter collection. So um, I'm not going to swatch this because I think I have this one here, 200. I'm not for sure, but whatever. Okay, Glam Beauties, that will conclude my uh, altar haul and my uh, little... Dollar Tree Hall. Until next time, Glam Beauties. <laughs> I don't know why I want to say booties. Uh, because y'all are my boo-boos. Uh, until next time, Glam Beauties. Smooches. Bye-bye. And I will link my uh, additional social media platforms at the top. Right up there, 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 there. Okay. Love you. Bye-bye.